A Tempe man rented his house on Airbnb and then came back to find it trashed. Thousands of dollars in damage and the renter who had a fake name was long gone. The whole party was caught on the home security cameras. Team Charles William Pitts has more on what happened and how this man is now trying to get his money back. Charlie Brum's house was absolutely trash. There was glass all over the place. His furniture, for some reason, moved into the kitchen. And instead of seven guests, he now had dozens of people having a party in his home. The only thing Charlie could do was watch from the other side of the country on his security camera. Actually, what it reminds me of is like literally a band trashing a hotel. Charlie would know he works with bands on tour, but even this. That rug's in the garbage now. Would be a little much for a rock star. Charlie rented his house on Airbnb. He says it was supposed to be seven people, all family. He left town for Boston and his phone started blowing up. There was a massive party at his house. Cops at his door more than once. People running around his house with booze, his booze. My liquor cabinet that used to be full. Now, what kind of thief leaves the most expensive bottle Probably the same kind of person that left this behind. There's there's the rolling station. And when the party was over, his house was a disaster. So this is actually a flat screen TV that might appear to be a curved, the new curved model, but it is not. It used to be full of clothes. So they, they stole all my personal clothes. Hard to believe, but there's a guy on camera dropping hangers on his way out. Um, and yeah, <laughs> condoms. Two weeks later, Charlie's still putting his house back together. Probably going to be about 16 K. He's thrown things out, called in professional cleaners, changed all his locks. He submitted a claim to Airbnb, and that's when he saw his guest's name. Jason Bourne. Charlie said he requires a driver's license to rent, but says Airbnb gets that, not him. He's hoping they know who really rented his house because he knows Jason Bourne is a fake. We asked Airbnb about it. A spokesman said they're investigating and pointed to the company's million dollar guarantee. The spokesman said only 0.004% of its 49 million bookings in 2017 led to damage claims over $1,000. We did the math. That's 196,000 claims. I got paid. I still got my, I still got the, the fee. Now, it didn't obviously didn't cover what's going on here. As for running out his house, he says he probably won't be doing that again. So far, it's been lucrative, uh, obviously up until now. William Pitts, 12 News. Okay, so if Jason Bourne ever tries to rent your house or James Bond, yep. look Denied. twice. Yep. Yeah.